Hero Race was held to benefit our organization, CASA, which provides trained volunteer advocates who spend their time advocating in court for abused and neglected kids. CASA is so lucky to have been chosen by the Superhero Foundation, not only here in Pittsburgh, but across the nation in cities like Austin, Atlanta, Richmond, and then here in Pittsburgh to have 5Ks and races to benefit CASA programs who spend their time fighting child abuse. Our volunteers provide a consistent voice for children. It's their job to know kids who are in the system better than any professional out there, to visit with them, talk to professionals, and then to report to the judge as to what's in their best interest, to really advocate in court for what they need. So their journey through the child welfare system, which can sometimes be really trying and, and very lengthy. Our CASA volunteers make sure that the kids aren't forgotten in a really confusing and overwhelmed public system. So we're so thankful to the Superhero Foundation with the money raised today. We'll be able to provide trained advocates who will follow a child through the system until their case is closed, which unfortunately for kids can be several years. In Pittsburgh, this is our third year, um, but this is the first year benefiting CASA of Allegheny County. Um, nationally, I know it's been going on for a little while longer, and I believe it started in Austin, Texas. And the race in Austin, which will be in the fall, will have well over a thousand people. So we're really proud here in Pittsburgh. I think we've broken 500, which is much larger than years past, and we're, and we're very excited about it. Well, our office is downtown, and, and really it begins by calling our office, which is 412 594 3606 or visiting our website which is www.pgh-casa.org or you could also visit the superhero website which is superherorun.com and there's a link to our program right there on their website and you call um, get more information and we can start you in the process of being trained to become a CASA volunteer so just a big thank you to the Superhero Foundation to Erica Charneyberg and her team for making this event such a huge success we are very very grateful Anthony here with Erica, the chief operating superhero of the Superhero Run 1K and 5K here in North Park. Now, you organized this entire event, and this is the third year that you've done said event. What organizations have you helped over the years with this event? So for the first two years, we helped uh, Family Resources, and this year was our first year with CASA of Allegheny County. And we doubled in size from last year. We had about 264 people last year, and we had somewhere over 500 today. That's wonderful. And how much time do you spend planning this event each year? A lot. <laughs> I, uh, I take the summer off, and then starting in September, we start all over again looking out for uh, sponsors. So if anyone out there wants a sponsor for next year, you can contact me at Pittsburgh at the superherofoundation.org. It's never too early to start for next year. Fantastic. And a question that I personally want to know the answer to. You've done this for three years, and you've had to have seen some amazing costumes over the years. What are some of the highlights that, you've, that you remember from the past three years? So last year was a real good one. We had, um, I can't remember his name, the guy with the underwear and the belt on his head. Oh, Quail Man. Quail Man, yes, that would be him. Uh, we had Quail Man here, um, so that was great. And I think... Uh, Mikey and Bob today were uh, a standout with their underwear on the outside of their uh, their pants as well. Um, and the run in Richmond we had last year, we had uh, the pilot from uh, the plane of the Hudson. Oh, so uh, that was a very original costume. It was one of the best ones I've seen. Fantastic. And how can people get in touch with you if they want to help you with the event? Again, that same email address, Pittsburgh at the superherofoundation.org. Uh, they could also call me at 724-466-HERO, which is 4376. <laughs> Wonderful. Uh, congratulations on such a great event that helps so many people. And we hope to come back next year. Great. Thank you very much.